amazing. But just the tiny little extra bit of uh, connection that I can make with people, it really makes a difference. So, hey guys. Jesse's feeling a little under the weather, so it's just Harper and me today, and we are going out to the market. Harper wants to get some toys, and I've gotta get some veggies and all kinds of stuff, and they're having the art thing again today. Look, guys. Baby. So the broth is really spicy and really flavorful. And there is like pretty much every type of like meat in here. Um, all the bits that, that we um, US folks don't usually eat. So let's see. That one's a little slimy. Not gonna lie. Pretty sure that this might be um, tripe. Might be stomach or intestines. I think stomach. It's a little chewy. Mm. So the broth is like level 10 amazing. Not loving the meat. But, uh, <laughs> but I'm glad I tried it. Alright, let's see if I can do the tortilla like like my tummy. No? There we go. Alright, I gotta have more practice with that, but.
Harper and I just got back from the market, so let me show you what I got. All right, I got a couple of soap dispensers. These were 90 pesos a piece. And I bought this game that one of you guys suggested we get. I think it's La Loteria. Um, I had no idea how to play it, so I'm gonna ask Google, and uh, maybe Jesse and Harper and I can play this later on. Oh, and I got a mirror. I love these mirrors, I think they're so cool. Uh, this was 150 pesos. You know, I have not done enough, uh, I've not done enough shopping to know whether the market prices are decent prices or tourist prices, so, um, I don't know, my guess is probably tourist prices, but. All right, so everything in this bag was 97 pesos altogether. I got four corns. They had white corn and yellow corn, and the lady told me that the yellow corn was sweeter, and I understood her, and I was so happy. And some avocados, one more avocado sneaking out there. A couple of red uh, onions, and she threw in this guy for free. So, so yay, happy times. Okay, I forgot I had these in the fridge. Um, all right, these and these uh, all together came up to 204 pesos. I wish YouTube had a weight like sensor. These things are massive and so heavy. I think they are like a roasted sweet potato yam situation. And I, I meant to buy two. I may have ended up buying, I'm not sure if I bought two Gigantor ones or four. I'm not even sure how many I ended up with. Um, <laughs> and I don't know how to eat them, so I'll be Googling that too. Are you supposed to have them hot? Are you supposed to have them cold? I don't know, one of you guys mentioned on one of the market videos, um, I think you were pointing them out, so I was like, oh, okay, I'm gonna try that. Okay, and then also a couple mangoes, Harper's favorites, and a couple dragon fruit, Harper's second favorite. So, oh, okay, so I have only one week left of my super crazy intensive Spanish class and um, classes. And it is really exciting because I feel like every time I go to the market, I can say a little bit more and I understand a little bit more. And it's like, oh, and I don't understand everything. Um, and I don't catch everything and I don't say everything right. But just the tiny little extra bit of uh, connection that I can make with people, it really makes a difference. So even just the little itty bitty thing of the lady telling me, asking me if I wanted white corn or yellow corn and then telling me that the yellow corn was sweeter. Like even that like mm, teensiest, tiniest little bit of interaction just made me feel so happy and like just more of a part of this place. And so I'm so glad, I'm so glad. Taking those Spanish classes has been the best thing I have done in a long time, so. Ah, I'm making a video about the Spanish classes. I'll release that soon. Um, but yeah, I think I'm gonna go make some food now. Happy market times. See you guys later. Hey!